So I want to remind you again, the things you need to do, take care of the need, minister to them. Christmas is coming, it's an opportunity. Those of us who are from villages where people, uh, there are those of us who may be fortunate, the village where you are coming from, everybody seems to be doing well. There are other places. Do something substantial. It has not changed. Feed the hungry, clothe the naked, provide shelter for the homeless, visit the sick, pay hospital bills, go to the prison, see what you can do. Which other one? I was anxious and you calmed my fear. My sister, do not be afraid. Oh, you've not got a child. Don't worry. Don't kill yourself and all of that. See what you can do to help people. That's all. There are two sins that will take us to hell, the sin of commission and the sin of omission. And it looks like more people will go to hell because of the sin of omission. So maybe God is giving us the opportunity to plan ahead. Christmas is coming. And I don't want it to be only something you do during Christmas time. And anything that is stopping you from doing this thing is the enemy that you must conquer as king, as Christ conquered. The Lord is asking us to remove the goat nature, the goatish nature, and put the sheepish nature. John 10, I know my sheep and they know me. I call them and they do what? They follow me. Goat, G is for greed. When we are too greedy, to even remember the needs of others. We are good. Oh no, you are good. <laughs> okay, they are good. Anyone who is too greedy to consider the, the needs of others, that G, say good, greed. Greed makes any human being a good, no matter who the person is. Oh, it's obstinacy. Yes, when we are obstinate, when we are stubborn in our sins, when we refuse to make effort to change. That is good. What is the next one? A is addiction. We are too addicted to our vices. We are addicted to ourselves, to our own desires and all of that. It becomes a habit. You have built a fine house in your village. Maybe among your uncles, among your relatives. You are the only one who has... Very big giant house, but every Christmas, all you do, you go home, change the paint, change furniture. But around you, there are people with touched houses. You've never one day said, Take these 2,000 blocks. That you are addicted only to yourself. Yeah, you go to a hey, Then the last one is what? What is even T? It can be tenacity. Tenacity is sin. You don't want to give up. One day, the chicken and the goats. They were friends. They were walking along the road discussing. Then one man drove his car mm, and passed and splashed water, dirty water on them. And, you know, with the speed car, the chicken just shook. What else he said on her head and said, these human beings, these are they be driving like goats. His friend, the goat, looked at him. Shuki says, hey, don't mind them. That's why they die like chickens. <laughs> Even animals know where human beings behave like animals. How much more we? The Lord is asking us to be sheep. It's not an insult. It's a metaphor. To watch full videos and get notifications for new ones, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. God bless you. Sign up with the largest community of Catholics online, make new friends, chat, post pictures and videos, make and receive audios and video calls, interact with lots of priests and religions, download the app from Google Play Store.